Hi everyone! Welcome back to Korean with Rose. Today I'm going to talk to you about pronunciation of double patim. Double patim. We have to divide this case into case of noun and case of verbs and adjectives. First in noun, there are five kinds of double patim, which are these. Only one consonant in double patim can be pronounced as shown in this chart. When noun is on its own, or when in the first position of next following word, there is a consonant, only one consonant in double patim can be pronounced. These are pronounced kap, mok, tap, yodol, wegul. When there comes vowel after double patim, linking happens, which is called yonum. So we get to pronounce every consonant in double patim. I'll cover this in the video of yonum. There are nine double patim in the case of verbs and adjectives. Only one consonant in double patim is pronounced when it's on its own or there comes consonant after this double patim, as shown in this chart. These are pronounced opta, upta, itta, anta, anta, tamta, nolta, halta, ilta. When there comes vowel after double patim, linking, which is called yonum, happens, so we pronounce every consonant in double patim. I'll cover this in the video of Yonum in detail that I mentioned earlier. I hope that this was helpful. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I will see you in the next lesson. Until then, see you soon. Mm -hmm.